Right, good morning all. Welcome back to the uh, daily vlogs on the ski trip. Um, Weather-wise, it's cleared up a bit, which is good. It's um, not raining or windy down here anymore, but apparently it is cold up the mountain, like really, really cold. Um, today, apparently, we're having to hire chains, so we've got a pair of chains from the local shop to use if we need them. We're both wearing like double merino layers, double polypros. And potentially it could be cold and windy, potentially it could close while we're up there. We're just going to see what happens. Worth the shot since we're here. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Alright. So we've arrived at Mount Hutt, but there is a slight situation. Cars all jammed up at the bottom of the mountain because apparently they've got trees across the road from the wind last night. So we are just hanging about and apparently they'll be cleared soon. Quite a way back now, guys. Jeez. <laughs> They haven't got home we did. But look, oh no, the weather. Yeah. Don't know, it's, it's starting to rain and it's getting windier. Can't see Mount Hutt, we've lost the sun to the cloud. I'm not sure what's gonna happen. Those Maybe. poor cows over there. It's not skiing in the rain that um, worries me. Yeah. It's like the driving on frozen water that worries me yeah. and the wind and it's mainly like the, the biggest thing about bad weather with, with the Mount Hutt is that Bad weather is just not good for trying to drive up there. Yeah. Because it's like a pretty simple road and it gets cold. Be no problem. Like if it was bucketing down or blizzarding, I'd still take a gondola up and like ski. Yeah. But it's just for driving. I think I think we're like the first people up, apart from staff. Cool. <laughs> it actually looks so scary out there. I'm yeah. guessing the floor isn't actually running because no one's up there yet. Yeah, maybe. Like, yeah. Because they're probably still like preparing and like sorting everyone out. Yeah, they haven't even got any person here to tell me where to park. There's a bunch of people waiting. Wait, is that people yeah. or? Yeah. Oh, yeah the buses they're like, are up there. there's someone there. Yeah, there's like four cars oh, and four we're buses. To park all the way up there. That's not that bad. <laughs> I want to park just by the door. <laughs> Holy crap, it's quiet. I hope yeah, they're actually going to start the lift. He's directing me, so... Oh, good. So, we've, we've made it up the top. It's not quite white out, but it is snowing at the moment, which is good. I mean, snow is good for powder and stuff like that. Um, we l we were waiting for about an hour at the bottom, I think, weren't we? Yeah, about an hour. About, about 8.30 to 9.30. No, wait, we got there at 9. And, and we, we waited until, until about 10. 10 and yeah. then we've driven up. And so, so we waited for an hour at the bottom. And, 10.37 now, so it's been about a 30 or 40 minute drive up. Yeah. I'm gonna stick my hand out, see how cold it is. Oh, God. oh yeah! <laughs> Should I wear my pumper jacket under my skin? None of the chairlifts are going yet. <laughs> well, guys, the conditions are. Like they're not very good for filming and the GoPro case is already starting to fog up so I think what I might do is actually just leave the camera in the car for a wee bit. If the conditions clear up I'll get it out and try and do some filming but you're not going to be able to see anything in this weather anyway so yeah sorry I'm not going to bring the camera with me today. Right. Well the weather's cleared up much better. I mean it's not perfect but you can still a lot more visibility than there was this uh, morning. Jess is just in the car with the heater on warming up a wee bit we're having a bit of food. Um, Jesus, it's bitterly cold. So since the weather's cleared up a bit and the sun's come out, I'm going to take the GoPro up with me and try and get some shots. Unfortunately though, like last time, well not Tuesday afternoon, the six and three, the six seater and the three aren't going just before, so we can only really get halfway up the mountain, which is you know, disappointing, but we're just going to have as much fun as we possibly can. Yeah, looks nice. So we had our lunch, I came up here to do some snowboarding and on the first few runs for some reason my GoPro wouldn't start recording, so that was great. Came down, fixed that, then after I'd fixed that Jess decided she wanted to warm her toes up a wee bit so we waited 10 minutes. Come back out and now no one else is allowed on the chairlift. For at least another 10 minutes they have to wait for the winds to come down. Which to be fair are quite strong with it going back and forth, back and forth. 
so we're just gonna wait, I guess. I guess so. Today was all fun, but sadly they have closed the mountain early because it's too dangerous to use the chillis and that means that we have to come down sooner because the road's going to get dangerous apparently, although it's okay down here, but um, yeah, the wind has caused some troubles and sadly the day has to end soon. Give a round of applause everybody! Me? Yeah. <laughs> now, so um, sadly I did not get any footage of skiing today, somehow. Because for the first sort of half before lunch, a we got up late, got up there late because of the delay at the bottom. So we got up there late. So the break between starting and lunch was short, and I didn't film for that part because it was just ridiculously windy and quite, um, I don't like. It was almost whiteout-ish. Just couldn't see anything, so it wouldn't have looked good on camera. We had some lunch, but then I decided after lunch I was going to do some filming. So I went and got the GoPro. That's when it decided, after I had, you know, filmed lunch, that's when it decided it would have another one of its weak meltdowns and wouldn't record once we got up there. And then after I fixed it, inside, in the warmth, we sat for a wee bit for just to warm their toes up, went back outside, and at that point they closed the chairlift. Which was going, which, at first they just put it on hold, which was like, hopefully going to be like 15 minutes. It ended up being like an hour and at that point they just decided to close the mountain. That is why today's vlog has included no actual shots of us skiing. Hopefully the weather is better tomorrow. Better be. Better be because like we've been looking forward to this. Yeah. That's not to say that it hasn't been fun though. I had a couple of really fun runs there, had the headphones on and the helmet. It was awesome. Yeah, what we did has been good. Cheers for watching today's vlog guys, hopefully the weather will be better for tomorrow's skiing of which will be our last day and then back home to reality, sadly. Okay, see ya. Uh. Every morning I wake up and grab a pencil and journey into the world of my mind that has the potential to take me to anywhere I imagine I travel into invisible space and focus to help me capture the physical realm Life is a journey and I'm living to dwell Some rappers want to test me lyrically, I'm giving them hell Something like a verbal mystic put them into a spell Something like my words are twisted like this is a pretzel